Understanding Stream Throttling, a guide for English learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore the meaning of a technical phrase you might encounter in the digital world. Stream throttling. This term is increasingly common, especially in discussions about internet usage and technology. So, let's dive in and understand what it means. First, let's break down the phrase into two parts, stream and throttling. Stream. In technology, a stream refers to a continuous flow of data or media, like videos or music, over the internet. Imagine a river flowing. Data streaming is similar, where data flows from the source, like a website, to the user. Throttling. Throttling is the intentional slowing down or speeding up of an internet service by an internet service provider, ISP. It's like controlling the flow of water through a hose. So, stream throttling means the deliberate slowing down or speeding up of the data stream by the ISP. Understanding why stream throttling happens is crucial. ISPs might throttle a stream for various reasons, such as managing network traffic to prevent congestion on the network, ISPs might slow down certain types of data streams. Data caps. If a user has a limited data plan, ISPs might throttle their speed after they reach a certain limit. Paid prioritization. Sometimes, ISPs might throttle certain services to promote others, often for financial reasons. The impact of stream throttling on users can vary. Buffering and slowdowns. Users might experience buffering or slowdowns while streaming videos or music. Quality reduction. The quality of videos might be reduced to adjust to the slower speed. Frustration for users. It can be frustrating for users who expect a fast and uninterrupted internet experience. Understanding. Stream throttling. Helps in better navigating the digital world especially for English learners who interact with technology-related content. We hope this explanation clears up any confusion about the term. Remember, as you encounter new technical phrases, breaking them down like we did today can be a helpful strategy. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.